Well, it is the season of giving, and if you want to get in the holiday spirit, you can head on out to the third annual Festival of Trees taking place this Saturday. News 13's Tess Rowland has more on how this event helps the local community. Hey there, Tess. Hey, good morning, Erin. Yes, the third annual Festival of Trees is going to be taking place this Saturday at the Edgewater Beach Resort from 6 to 10. And I'm actually joined this morning with Miss Pam Mathis. She is the event chair. So what can people expect from this event? These, uh, this event is going to be fully decorated Christmas trees, silent auction items, heavy hors d'oeuvres, dancing, live music, and just a lot of fun to kick off the holiday season. Most definitely. So the real excitement are these trees. So a lot of them are designed all different styles. Can you elaborate on that? So last year we had the Nightmare Before Christmas tree, which was amazing, very unique. We had one that was covered in fishing lures. We had a, um, a ocean themed tree there. Gnome Sweet Gnome. Oh. oh yes, that one was really <laughs> cute. So they're they're just different for everybody's taste, four feet all the way up to twelve feet trees. And you know, just come out by the tree and then we'll deliver it to you the next morning for a nominal fee. Wow, that's great there. And so how much are tickets? Tickets are fifty dollars and they are avail they are available online or at the door. And all of the proceeds go to a local charity. Yes, that is Gulf Coast Children's Advocacy and Life Management. Yeah, so what's your favorite part about the festival? Um, well, I do enjoy Christmas, so I think everything is my favorite, but I'm, I'm looking forward to relaxing at the end of the night and <laughs> doing some dancing. Nice, nice. And so you're decorating a tree yourself. I am, I am. And if you like jewel tones, and I understand that you do. I do. <laughs> and bling, my tree is going to be your favorite. Oh, well, that's something to look forward to there. Again, all different types of trees, all different types of designers, and all that goes to the Gulf Coast Children's Advocacy Center as well as life management. So a great cause there. You guys have raised a lot of money in the past. Their goal is $20,000 this year. And again, you can get tickets on our website, mypanhandle.com a little bit later this morning. News 13's very own Tom Lewis is going to be emceeing the event as well. So a lot to look forward to. Thank you so much, Pam. Absolutely. And for now, live in Panama City, Tess Rowland, News 13, Panhandle Strong.